Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. Got Hayden here as always, but we got something a little new for you. Got our first ever actual TCG play videos. Um, I'm doing doing an event in Pokemon TCG Online, uh, standard, and I'm gonna join with uh, ADP Sword Doggo, ADP Zation, one of the top meta decks in the format right now. Figured I'd just go through a quick deck tech while we're uh, waiting for the queue to pop. So this is ADP Zation. So we've got three Zations, your namesake card. You can use this to look at the top three cards, attach an energy to it, or draw. Um, and we just want to get him up to three energy and start hitting base for 230. ADP, uh, we're mostly using this for altered creation. Once we use that, our attacks do 30 more damage, and we get a prize card, an extra prize card, whenever we knock someone out. So we use that to kind of just outrace our opponent. We're just taking more prize cards than them. This ability ramps and lets us attach three basic energy, so we kind of like to lead with ADP, Get an altered creation off ASAP, ultimate ray the next turn, pump up our Zation, get some hitting for 260, and kind of go to town. We've got Intrepid Sword to help us dig deeper into our deck. We like to go first because we can play Intrepid Sword first turn, and this gets us a faster altered creation off. So on the supporter side, our draw Pokemon are pretty standard. Got two Crobats and two Dedenes. Both of them will draw us up to six cards. Dedene will just discard our hand first. Uh, Mawile is for the mirror and for Decidueye, lets us put Pokemon on the bench that they may be trying to avoid on the bench. Eldegoss lets us recur any supporter, and Oranguru just kind of lets us manipulate our hand in the top of our deck, which is really important because if Zacian is drawing, the, and the three cards Zacian draws, for any steel energy you draw you can attach it to him, so we can guarantee some ramps. Uh, two Cherish Balls, we don't have that many GX, use that to find ADP into Dene. This is a double crushing hammer build. Um, that's the meta right now. Energy spinner to find a water. Three energy switches. Uh, there's just a lot of energy management. Like if you're ever going to get a turn one altered creation off, you need an energy switch for it. Uh, one great catcher. We really like to bench snipe in this deck. And we like our supporters too. Four metal saucers. Great frustration. Pokemon catcher. Same reason as the great catcher. Four quick balls. Because it's quick ball. Three switches. Uh, Zation can't attack the turn after he uses Brave Blade, so that's how we get around it. Two Turbo Patch. We mill a lot of um, energy in this deck and kind of play with uh, Metal Saucer to begin with, and Turbo Patch works nicely there too. Chaotic Swell for Welder decks. Get rid of the Great Hearth. Three Bosses Orders for Sniping on the Bench. Three Barneys for Hand Disruption. Four Professors for our Draw Supporter. Uh, two Air Balloons to help us with Switching again. A Big Charm. This is for the mirror. We like to throw this on um, on uh, ADP. It helps it survive two, I think, of the ultimate rays. Something like that. Um, and I'm not super great at this deck to begin with. Cape of Toughness is also for the mirror. And we put that on Zacian to survive uh, a Brave Blade from another Zacian. Eight steel, two water. So, yep. That's the deck. Um, Q should be popping soon. All right. The game has started um i'm feeling ahead here i'm really feeling the heads <clears throat> hell yeah this is adp sword doggo so we do want to go first it's our hand this actually isn't that bad because if we're going to get a hand that doesn't have adp or zation in it i would rather it be eldegoss actually this is the rest of the hand is terrible aggressively terrible because we have no turn one plays quick ball quick ball quick ball Ooh, that feels real bad. This is Sinta Scorch, so we are, um... We might. We might lose. We actually might. With a start like that, we are not in a good spot here. That kind of helps. He had a slower turn. Because we can Marnie now. Which, I mean, I think we Marnie. Because we lower his cards in hand. Uh, yes. Because I can't use any of those cards, dude. The questions this game asks you sometimes are kind of crazy. Cool. This was a really good one. This was a great one to pick up. Um, let's get rid of a Chaotic Swell. We, um, we're we going to pitch one of these Marnies. What do we have in prize cards? We've got a Zacian, a prize card. Crobat. Oh, our hammers. Ooh, I think we got our hammer and a prize card. We have, both of our, we have all of our bosses an energy and a prize card or so um okay that's fine uh we're gonna get zation here i mean we do need adp but 
Optimization is going to be more important. We need to draw cards. It's very key right now. Uh, we want an Oranguru, and we're just going to put the Marnie on top. We just want to get a little bit deeper into our deck. It's the boss. We're going to draw that card anyway. Okay. I mean, we're struggling with energy here. We, I mean, we obviously didn't want to attach the Steel Energy to the Eldegoss. That literally does nothing for us. So we didn't. Um, the Marnie has helped us a little bit. He at least doesn't have a full grip here. So at least five cards is to a seven or eight. Okay. We gotta keep get those. I guess he discarded them to quick fall and whatnot. Oh, this is a Charizard deck. Interesting. Okay. This is probably a decent matchup for us because we still get two prize cards from their Charizards, which is not what they're looking to do. Yeah, he's got the Snorlax. I wish it... There we go. Uh, this, I don't think this has a retreat cost. No, it doesn't. So he's probably going to use Gourmandize. Yep. Which means I might just Marnie to cut into his hand again. Okay, that helps. That helps a lot. Oof. But the problem with this is we're in absolutely no position to be able to energy spinner and do this and get ADP and a water energy. That's kind of rough. Uh, does that mean we're Marnieing here? Probably. I think I attached this. I got Marnie again. Do we have a steel energy in here? We don't. That's good lord, dude. Look at this. This is a this is just brutal. Um, we always put the energy on top because it means we can ramp it on Zation at a worst case scenario. Uh, and then boss's orders. That's not what we're looking for. Switching up professor's research. That's a little bit better. That means we at least have a good chance of getting Sword Doggo front and center attacking next turn. Which, I mean, that's something. That is something. There's a the scoop up net. Okay. I mean, that's... That's not great. Actually, that's largely fine. We don't really care about that hand. It wasn't really doing that much for us. Uh, this is realistically probably a better hand. I think we're going to pitch... Actually, no, we're not going to pitch the Professor. Ooh, no, we are going to pitch the Professor, I think. Oh, that's his weakness? Ugh, brutal. Okay. But realistically, we want to attach... Realistically, we want to attach the Steel Energy to Zacian this turn. Finally. Hello. Hello. That means some interesting things here. I don't think there's a world where we get Altered Creation off this turn. I think we need to start duking it out with Zation. Which means I think this Water Energy has to go. Uh, what do I want here? And we have the research. I'm probably... It's our likelihood of... We have two more researchers in our deck. We should have grabbed the Crobat first. We'll take the Dead A in case we need it. We do need it. Big Charm goes here. This is why Rangaru is so good. I don't think we care about the boss as much as we care about keeping our cards going. That's a huge deal. That means we could boss here if we wanted to, but I think we just take out the Talon Flame. That gets rid of all of his energy. And then next turn, we can switch twice before bossing. And okay, that seems good. That seems like the play. I think at this point we're so far behind on like energy. I don't know how we get an altered creation off. Cape is good. Cape goes on Zaysh. Air Balloon is really good. Air Balloon is really really good. Um, Air Balloon, probably going on Crobat. I mean, you put Snorlax out, right? So you can Gourmandize. So yeah, we're probably putting Air Balloon on Crobat, because, I mean, it gives them free retreat cost. It lets us only use one of our switches. Though, ultimately, it doesn't matter, because we're going to 
probably discard this hand when all's said and done. Actually, I don't know. I mean, the main, like, the main form of hand disruption uh, in the meta right now is um, just a Marnie. I mean, everyone's running four of Marnies, but, like, because it's a Marnie, that means if we hang on to just Dead A and maybe one or two other cards, like, the worst case scenario is we'll draw two more cards, uh, which is obviously fine. And the best case scenario is we keep Dead A, we pitch him, and we draw six cards, which is great. Um, we're drawing pretty slow for a game of Pokemon. I think we both are, me and opponent. Um, but I like where we're at. I really actually like where we're at, which is kind of surprising given, given our start. So, I mean, we'll see what opponent has. He's got the welder. Okay. I mean, he can't, well, he could have a rare candy, but he only has one Leon and he's already played a welder. So that's going to make things kind of hard for him. This is, like, the most nerve-wracking thing. Is if he can attack with this Charizard this turn and kill my Zage. I think he kills it no matter what. Shit. Ooh, now I don't like where we're at. Now I really don't like where we're at. Oh, my God. This is really bad. is really bad he's looking for like a switch please don't pull he's got so many cards in hand i don't think it explicitly means the game is over i don't if he doesn't have the switch i love our position but i'm super nervous okay Oh my god, yes, he doesn't have the switch. Woo! Woo! We've been orchestrating this turn. We already know we're going to boss this. We're going to kill it. Get rid of it. Uh, let's. We're going to put the professors on top so we make sure we have one for our next turn. There's no need to energy switch right now. Let's go ahead, Jamma Dedene. We're looking for an energy. That's actually pretty rough. Well, kill the Charizard. This forces him to have a lot of things to rebuild next turn. Which is what we want. We also want energy, but we're struggling to find it. Now, if he has the welder and the rare candy, he's got the rare candy. Does he have the welder? Probably going to find it with that. He's already got a Leon in there. He's got two Leons in there. Oh my god, dude. I mean, right now, he probably doesn't have the welder, otherwise he would have played... Oh, nope, there it is. He's had it the whole time. He's just been slow rolling it. Ugh, okay. This makes things really tough, because... I haven't drawn, like, any energy all game, man. That is brutal. That is so brutal. I mean, yeah, this is a game that if we would have had really any draw go better... I think we could have just easily won, but we've gotten screwed just across the board. Um, we obviously don't care about that. I don't know how we win this. Metal Saucer helps here. You know, I think we went on the backization. I think we do. This is our last turn. I think we lose the game if we can't put Zacian online here. Oh, thank God. We could switch. Yeah. 
Yeah, we go in deeper for the switch. Okay, so first we quick ball this. Uh, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna grab this. Then, Primate Wisdom Professor's Research. Keep that. That's good for us. Still no switch, man. Is there a switch in here? Yeah, there's a switch in here. There's a switch and an air balloon. Still no switch. So we draw. I think we lose. Yeah, I think this is it. I think this is like the fastest tournament ever. So I'm telling you, I don't... I don't know how my opponent... Yeah. We can see. Oh, that sucked. That sucked. That was a rough tournament. We drew terribly. I mean, we missed our first two energy drops. We had absolutely no Pokeballs or draw cards. That was, um... That was rough, folks. That was one of the, uh... That was one of the roughest games I have ever played with that deck. We can leave the event now. We'll still get our rewards. That's... Well, that's it. That's it for the video. I guess this is a super short one. Because the tourney's over. Uh, you know what? You guys came here for something. You find folks. So let's get a couple more games of ADP Sword Doggo in. Let's see how this deck really should play. Because that... That game did it a disservice. We didn't even draw our crushing hammers. We could barely interact with our opponent. Like, man, that was a rough draw. How brutal was that game? I mean, literally, since we had three prize cards left, if we would have hit any amount of energy early on to the point where we could have ADP'd, and maybe we should have developed more to ADP and forced the ADP, but I, I just felt we were in too late. But, like, it's one of those things where if we could have gotten our ADP online earlier and we weren't in too late, we would have just won the game. Because, I mean, we had three prize cards left. And if we're taking an extra prize card, I guess, no, we would have had one prize card left. So maybe we wouldn't have won the game. It's an interesting thing to think about. Or would we? I don't even remember what we killed. Oh, yeah, we got the... We, 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 it's an interesting thing to think about. Because of this? What is this? Uh, okay, that's fine. Um, okay. So, this is good. This is actually this is a great hand. This is the hand we want to start with. Uh, we'll get a Zaysh on that quick ball. We're going to grab a Dedene with this. Uh, we're missing a Crushing Hammer. We're missing an Energy Switch, I believe. Uh, oof. Maybe we've got two Switches in there. I don't know this deck list that well. we got a boss. No. Oh, we've got two Marnies in there. That's the big thing we've got in there. Or one Marnie. Okay, that's better. Um, honestly, we don't... Uh, I don't even know what my opponent's doing at all. But I'm just failing to find on them. doesn't matter. Uh, 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 it doesn't matter. Let's grab Zation. I do think we played Dedene here, because another Pokeball lets us get a Rangaroo. And setting a Rangaroo up early is pretty sweet across the board. That's another Quick Ball. Um, for that, we are going to pitch the Metal Saucer. We can't set two of those up right now, so we may as well not even bother. I think right now, the most important thing to keep safe... Well, I guess we won't keep anything safe. Um, do we even bother with this? I don't think we even bother with that. Because we're going to Intrepid Sword anyway. Yeah, that's why we don't. By not bothering with that. Because we knew we weren't going to put a Steel Energy on the top of our deck. And we were going to draw those same three cards. Uh, oof. That's okay. We have Energy Switches in the deck. The Metal Saucer. Okay, this is like a, some sort of control... Slowing deck? You're trying to mill me? Is that what you're trying to do, opponent? I don't like it either way. Opponent, I don't. I don't, I don't, I don't. We can switch. It doesn't do a lot here. I'm gonna go ahead and throw an air balloon on this Orangaroo. Uh, we can also, with the Goss, we can get back a Marnie. That's something. 
let's I don't I don't want to play this extraization just yet I have a feeling we are switching we should have played that boss now that I think about it it's fine we're going to we're not Eldegossing right now yeah I think we just jammed the research oh no we can't boss Ugh, that's rough Oh man, I'm all over the place. I am all over the place. Do we just chill? Let's just chill. Actually. That's so what buddy Tyler says. I'll hold. Because he's always playing poker, apparently. That was a misplay. We should have played the boss. We did not. That is okay. Still, I would not. I definitely wouldn't say this is the deck I know the best. Um, I know the. Uh, oh man, are you gonna hit another crushing hammer? Yep. Yep. Jeez, dude. We are never gonna get to fucking altered creation GX at this rate. That's frustrating. It is what it is. It is what it is. Right now, while my opponent plays, I am ordering a Zacian Premium Collection. The steel one. Okay, that's sweet. That's like exactly what we wanted, just about. Um, and then, to, to be totally honest with you, uh, like, what are you trying to do here, opponent? Deck if you use his ability to turn ends. You're just trying to mill me out. Which means these bosses are going to be really important. Okay, we need to stop drawing. I'm pretty sure. This is fine. A prize card. We keep getting in these games where like getting altered creation off is like pulling teeth. You know a supporter card, that's fine. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Alright, there we go. Got some toilet paper too to make it free shipping. Sweet. I actually wasn't paying attention to what he put on the top of his deck. I'm not super concerned. Man, look at this hand. This hand is full of draw, and I don't think we want to draw at all. I want a water energy is what I want. Uh, not getting one. No, we don't want that, so let's go ahead and just shuffle away our deck. We also don't want this. I don't want to find either, though. Oh my god. Oh my god. I put this on the wrong Pokemon. I've never played this matchup. Just pass the turn. Oh, shit. So I don't even know what my opponent's doing. Ah, because I didn't see he put that down. I didn't think he'd see he put that down. That was my problem. Totally missed that. I wasn't paying attention during his turn. Yeah, he's just trying to mill me. Hello? What? Why can't? What do you mean? I no? can't okay, retreat.
Oh, great. How cool. How cool. How cool. I don't even want to play this game anymore. My opponent is very annoying. Super obnoxious, dude. <sighs> opponent, opponent, opponent. This is another one where if my opponent hadn't hit a million hammers and we had hit a water energy, like, altered creation is a huge deal here. Okay, thank God. It's like, you can only hit so many hammers, dude. Come on. Can we get a swell? A swell would be a huge deal. Didn't I? You cannot fucking get rid of you, can you? This is also useless because he doesn't have any GX. Um, okay, this this at least lets me search for a water energy. There we go. He can only have one more crushing hammer in the deck. I guess that's his strategy. Oh my god. Oh my, dude! I, don't, I honest to god don't even want to play this anymore. Oh, I don't think I have any more switches. Okay, we're just gonna concede because I just don't even want to play this. This is you win, opponent. Your win condition is boredom. Like I don't want to sit through this. This is not going to be fun at all. While you think, and I just have to sit here. So, congrats. Your deck is super, super cool, dude. Your deck is super cool and super fun. Good for you. We misplayed the hell out of that game. Swapping the Oranguru in. <sighs> ah, hello, opponent. How are you? Ah, damn you, opponent. Dude, I cannot, like, get a hand that starts with ADP or Zaysh. Man. Oh. There we go. It's already looking bad from the get-go. At least we do get to research. That is true. Since we go second, we actually get to research here, which means we can just look for ADP. There's a super small world where we altered creation on turn one. When I say super small, I mean super, 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 super small. So I don't think it's happening. Oh, just thinking about my last opponent's deck is just making me angry. It's just so boring. Like, oh my god. How, how can... I don't even know how you can play that. Like... We were just going to sit there for 20 more turns, dude. I mean, I think I had a Chaotic Swell and another Air Balloon, so I think I could have eventually gotten at least my Pokemon back, but... Man, did I not care to do that. Um... We're not going to use the Great Catcher. Uh, Oranguru, da -da 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 -da, both. Okay, we have the... We're missing our other Crobat, and we're missing our other Dedenne, so most of the Pokemon in there are draw uh, Pokemon, which isn't great for us. Um, we're missing a Chaotic Swell. Missing one of our bosses. I think everything else is energy. Okay. So we want ADP here. Then we want a Crobat into Professor's Research. Uh, I think we want this in the yard, actually. Which means this is only going to draw us two. Which is okay. I actually didn't want to draw those two. I think it's Steve Adora deck. Uh, non GX. See, now we really, 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 really need something to get a Zaysh. That is not something that will get us a Zaysh. Just in case he Marnies. I don't really want that stuck up there. I mean, he's probably going to alter creation. I don't know how he doesn't. He's got everything set up for it. Which puts us in a pretty bad spot. Because he's also an energy ahead because he had the Zation. Maybe we should have taken the Zation instead of the ADP. That I don't know. Yep, it's the creation. We know we're getting a Marnie. Um, I don't love Marnieing here for 
so many millions of reasons. So can we get something better? Not really. I don't even want the steel energy, man. Okay. Okay. That was actually a huge deal. This was a really good Marty. We get to Metal Saucer. We get to Altered Creation on Curve. This is when we wanted to be Altered Creationing. I mean, we wanted to do it our first turn, but that's super hard. Uh, now it's an interesting fight. Now I don't know how we get the edge, because our opponent's going to Ultimate Ray first. Um... But then we'll ultimate ray right back, and both of these will be at like 100 health. Which is okay. Um, I really wish I still had the Cape of Toughness so I could put that on Zaish. It's really important in the mirror. Make Zaish survive with, at 10. Look how cute that is. Look, he's just the cutest Pokemon in the world. Wow. He's got a lot of different arts of him. This is the Pokemon Trainer's Toolbox. Okay. Okay, opponent, okay. Alright. That's terrible for us. Yeah, that's gonna give him a huge advantage. I think that might just win him the game. Because there's no way we get a boss and an energy with what we have. And all that means is he has to switch and then just have a boss and he wins. That was not what we needed. That was not how we tilted the game in our favor after going second and not hitting any good interaction for our opponent. Again, this is not what we want. This still doesn't matter. Throw the big charm on this. Can't even hit the hammer. Um, we should do this. We should always do this. One more boss and we lose. Um, and I mean, I think we just lose as is right now with the cadence of the game. The cadence and speed of the game, I think we just lose as is. Because we don't have a cave of toughness. At any point in time, if our Zaish comes out and gets a kill... What? Uh... Uh, okay. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, opponent. I don't know if you had to do that. I really don't think you did, opponent. I think you had that one just about on lock. But, you know, I will take any win no matter how I get it. I'll be honest with you, I'll take any win no matter how I get it. So, you, this at least gives us three games, so we didn't end on one game. So, I'm probably going to call a video there. Uh, two not-so-great games and one very confusing game. Maybe two very confusing games and one not-so-great game. Anyway, have a good night. Be good to one another. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you soon.